I just came down with, I don't know, yesterday half of the stage, you can start to feel it. But I think it's more the allergies than anything, but I don't know. It's not uh, not going well so far, you know. You know, I came here with, in really good form. And it's just got, you know, one, one crash and started everything, you know. But we'll see. Today is uh, the stage sprint and uh, I hope to make a good sprint, uh, same uh, same Napoli with Kev. I hope uh, I hope for this. I am here for this, and uh, I saw I have uh, the leg for uh, for take the, my first win in this year, and uh, I won't take this uh, today. Final, uh, very very confusion in the in the peloton, but Cav uh, and uh, Omega Far make a fantastic and perfect sprint. Uh, Stigmans uh, make a last 15 meter uh, perfect, and Cav uh, make um, I think the best sprint. Uh, I think uh, yesterday I don't think I can win because Cav is very very strong. Today is going to be hard. I mean, I'm in two minds. It's either going to be, it's either going to be full on. But it's one of those days where some guys could lose the race, but I don't think anyone's going to win it. Yeah, feeling good. And I think it's going to be fucking real hard today. Eh? Like uh, I've been hearing horror stories about it all morning from the boys at the Torino. So. We'll see. I mean, most people are already lining up at the start line, you know, there's half an hour to go, so it's yeah. the people on rollers, and yeah, it's going to be a fast start. And yesterday, full gas, and today I think uh, I no rest because it's strong uh, and uh, difficult stage, but uh, okay, in the, in the group and uh, easy. I don't think they plan the courses for the, if it rains, I don't even look at that, like, it's, I mean, it's probably awesome on TV, but for us it's just shit, you know? You had downhills, tight roads, and it's so slippery. Even the group header, you know, we had a uh, Dowsett crash right beside me. Got to the finish, it was cold, it was long, and then we had a 250k transfer, and yeah, it's not good. Yeah, it was pretty wet at the end. It was, uh, it was all right. I mean, the first hour was really difficult, and then um, after that, it sort of settled down a bit, and then just kind of rode until a point where I could, where there was a group forming behind that I could join and then once I got dropped, kind of cruised in, they uh, got bloody slipper in the end. The good thing about today is a big time cut <coughs> and uh, yeah, when I'm this crook, I think the main thing just to, to get through and with, I think I can lose like 20 minutes, so. It's not, it's like this is my day kind of thing. This is sort of the stage that I've had my eye on. Um, so yeah, I just feel like sort of, this is this is my day in the race where I can go for myself. You know, the team's given me an absolute. Like, they've been fully behind me, tackling this day as hard as I can. Um, and uh, yeah, just go as quick as I possibly can, really. This is horrible. It's, uh, it really is horrible going off early and then having to wait. I mean, um, obviously Wiggins is going to be. It's a, it's a massive ask to sort of turn over the Olympic time trial champion. Um, but we'll have to wait and see. I've done everything I can. If it's if it's not meant to be, it's not meant to be.
hasn't anywhere near sunk in yet. It's um, it's just the most unexpected and crazy thing. Yeah, a first Grand Tour and a stage win. Um, and spending a day in the white jersey, just, it's the stuff dreams are made of. Just wouldn't, yeah, I was hoping for a top 10 to win it. Is, uh, it's going to take a while to sink in. Tomorrow, I haven't really looked at it, so yeah, I think um, we'll have a, we'll try and get Ben out into the uh, pink jersey, so we'll see what we can do there. And um, you know, my my day is done now, so the rest of the tour I'll be looking at getting through and helping the team as much as possible. This is the Pinarello Belida of Bradley Wiggins. It represents another step forward in the evolution of time trial technology. This frame is quoted as being 15% more aerodynamic than its Grail predecessor and 